morning, guys. <clears throat> so Adrian didn't wake me up. So I got up at 4. It's 5.45 right now. I feel awful today. So I'm taking notes and we're watching a movie. So today's probably going to be a super short vlog. But good morning. Good morning. Um, I'm just going to do two days in one vlog. Um, obviously, I didn't close the vlog out, but I did so little yesterday that I figured it just wouldn't be a big deal if I just had it go into today. Plus, my um, stuff, my last like stuff that's due for my class um, is due tonight, and so I'm going to be spending a a good portion of the day doing the work and then thankfully my class will be over but um, obviously because of that I'm gonna have nothing interesting to you know do at all because I'm gonna be working on that stuff for so long so I'm in bed at Adrian still but my mom is gonna get me um, and then yeah when I get home I'll start the work just really feel terrible I really just felt awful and it just doesn't seem to be getting better. I think the only reason I'm like conscious and like kind of okay is because I took medication. Like woke up at like 5.30 with my stomach hurting so I had to take medicine for that. But I'll watch Undercover Boss and I'll see you guys soon. Hey guys, so I've been home for a while. Um, it's actually 6 and I started, I slept when I got home for a while and like an hour, hour and a half or whatever I really needed to. And, um, you know, I got up to do my schoolwork because it's due at midnight and I started doing it and on the discussion board thing, I saw that only like there were four. I think, and I think there's supposed to be 25 people in the class, although people probably did drop out. Um, I only saw four posts and it was due tonight, so I was like, you know, like, what's going on? Because that makes no sense that people were waiting until, you know, most of the class was waiting until um, 5 or 6 p.m. The, the night it was due to get it done. Um, obviously, a lot of people do it, but not you know, like s seven hours beforehand. Um, but anyway, um, I can't figure out, I, th I did something wrong and I think that I did something early when it was due another week, but I'm not sure the timing of this class at all right now. I'm so completely and utterly confused with what I did, yeah. Basically, I have no idea what's going on, and um, my laptop died, so I'm restarting it now, and I'm trying to figure out. I'm putting, like, the um, syllabus or the course uh, schedule or whatever next to, um, yeah, next to what I did, because I need to figure out what I did, because I really don't know what I did, so. Um. I guess the positive side is that I can take my pain medication because I was going to be holding off on that until I was done with schoolwork. So I can do that and I can go to bed at a reasonable time tonight and sleep. Um, so there's that. I'm not really sure what I did. I'll let you guys know. Okay, so from what I can see right now, I think it was that the due dates were skipped. So this one, that was the 18th, that's the 25th, okay, that's a week apart. Then this one jumps to 7-9, and then this one's 7-16. So I think I did 7-9 last, the 7-9 due date last week because I didn't realize that there was uh, a gap between these two. 
so yeah so what i'm gonna do is make sure that i did everything possible and um i guess we'll just have an easy night tonight the dessert wasn't it was like watermelon Hey guys, so it is quite late. As you can see earlier, I went on a walk with my mom, which I'm very proud of myself for. Um, it was after dinner, um, which I ate um, relatively well, but I need to, I don't know if I said anything in yesterday's vlog, but I've lost weight, so thought I was maintaining, gotta get back on that. Um, I, oh shit. All right, well, uh, that's about all, keep you guys updated. Um, but he is my friend that is a physical therapist, so he um, was able to look at my neck and my back that's been killing me, um, and like, pretty much, I mean, I had issues beforehand, but I had my seizures and it made it a lot worse, um, and, um, he basically felt out everything, and, um, he said the pain is all muscular, and that, um, it basically is coming from, like, the base of my, my head, and it goes down pretty much my entire spine. So I don't know if I showed you guys the other day, but I have a, f a foam roller that I just bought recently, and he said to really try to work it out on that, and try to see if I can get everything to loosen up a little bit. Um, and that, you know, obviously with the, the tense muscles, it's stupid. Yes, it's crap. It's just like everything is everything. Um, but, anyway, um, I'm going to do some stretching, but I need to make sure I get some videos up, um, but I want it to just update you guys, and yeah, he told me a whole bunch of ways to stretch to get, to safely get it to loosen up, and I have my TENS unit, which I probably talked about about a year ago, and probably nobody watching this has watched my videos a year ago, so, um, I'm going to start using, I think I've been using this the past handful of days, but um, I'm going to start using it on my neck and tell me exactly where I put it, so. Anyway, I just wanted to update you guys. Um, I have some videos to get up for you guys, too, but they're not up right now, so I'm going to work on that. Hey, I just wanted to close the vlog out. Um, I'm in bed. I used my TENS unit that I'll talk to you guys about tomorrow, um, and... I stretched and used the foam roller f to try to figure out what's going to work to get my back and my neck fixed. Um, I don't know if I said this, but my friend that I saw tonight um, is a physical therapist, so he checked out my neck and my back, and he just said that there's knots just, like, all the way down, so um, this foam roller should actually really help. With that so it felt nice while I was doing it hopefully I can like start seeing like benefits and stuff from it but I'll see you guys tomorrow thank you guys for watching